Cooper and Cassius IFL TV in association with MTK Global. We're at Brayhead Shopping Centre. I'm joined by Stephen Simmons, my old mate. How are you doing? How are you? Yeah, I'm great. You? Yeah. When's the last time I spoke to you? It wasn't December, was it? Must have been. That would when have been you December. In December? Yeah, yeah. But you fought again no, in March. No, December. It would have been October. October. Was it? Uh, yeah, at the um, Bell Houston Sports Centre, wasn't it? Was that October? 1st of October. We're nearer to this October than last <laughs> October. <laughs> it's been a while. Yes. But uh, you fought uh, in May recently, didn't you? Fought in May and I fought two weeks after I spoke to you yeah. as well. Okay, so what's the plan for this year then? Um, hopefully uh, title fights coming at the new part of the season, uh, September, October. That's, that's what the plan is, speaking to uh, Daniel and Anto, so just waiting. It's good to get on this and get some ring time, so... It seems to be kind of a new domestic scene, as well as obviously on the world scene, but a new wave of cruiserweights coming in now, isn't there? Uh, it's an exciting division. Yeah. Uh, it's been getting that way for the last few years. Uh, more and more coming in, the, the division's getting busier and busier. Uh, so I think it's one of the, the most exciting divisions out there. Mm. Uh, just have to look at the world scene as well. Really exciting. Obviously, over the last weekend, we saw... Uh, Isaac Chamberlain and Lawrence O'Coley in action. Obviously, they're being touted as a, a, a future fight. Um, any of them boys interest you? Not at the moment. They've, they've not got anything. Uh, they're, they're this is still... what Wadi Camacho said the other day. I Asking don't know why he's saying that. He's a journeyman. He's, uh, he's, uh, he's past. I don't know why he's saying that. But to be fair, uh, Isaac Chamberlain, he's not far away. So, But uh, O'Coley's still, still going through the rounds, through, the, through his paces. Um, but definitely these fights could happen next year. Mm. Um, obviously, if there's titles in the line as well, it makes much much more sense. Um, a lot of people have asked why I'm doing a six-rounder on this show. Uh, to, be, to be honest, I only got asked if I wanted to do a six-rounder on the show. I've uh, recently had a baby three and a half weeks ago. Congratulations, we saw the, yeah. the little nipper over there. Yep, so Takes after uh, the beauty of her dad, obviously. Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> uh, so I've had uh, had a couple of weeks out. The wife is in hospital and stuff, so I've been back in the gym now three weeks. Uh, so a six rounder made sense. And it's ring time, and it keeps me motivated for coming into the new season mm. and hoping to get a title fight. Uh, so that's my reason being that I'm only fighting a six rounder here. Mm. Did they ask you to go in that old tournament? No, no, I've not been asked for that. Mm. I, I, I think they're there's looking some serious for, names in there as well, yeah, isn't there? World, there's yeah. three world champions in there, yeah. and by the looks of it, I reckon they'll be going for the Dennis Lebedev for the, for the next position, just so they've got the four world champions in it, but it looks exciting anyway, uh, and I'll be intrigued to watch it. Definitely. Uh, what's your prediction for the main fight this Saturday between O'Hara Davis and Josh Taylor? Uh, Josh Taylor won. Josh Taylor, I think. Uh, you re reckon he'll knock him out? Uh, I don't know, I think it could move a good distance. He's got power to knock him out, but I think uh, it's, got, it's a distance fight. And, uh, I believe Josh Taylor will come out on top comfortable on points as well. A very, very clever boxer, more than what he gets um, made out to be. So, yeah, points win, I think, for Taylor. But I'd like to see him get the knockout. Okay. Um, Craig's just started his rant over there, so uh, I'm sure we'll catch up with you again this week anyway, yeah. Stephen, all right? Definitely. 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 All right? Good to see you, mate. Top man.